Good afternoon, everyone, and welcome to today's episode of the Official Art Podcast number 281. My name is Coach Mistletoe, and I'm here live with the core team. Your host for tonight, as always, the one and only Mr. Atlas. The floor is all yours, sir. Thank you for the floor, Coach Mistletoe. I won't be speaking. I'm still in my travels. I'll chat with the Carpathian Mountain. Probably didn't hear much of that. So I'll turn it over to a good friend, Ms. Nordy, for some updates, and then we'll do some reading. Sounds good. Looking forward to it. Yeah, today uh, Alex made some great progress on the tarot cards. We are moving along, uh, staying on track. Uh, he's got most of the front end stuff finished now, so it's going to be moving into the final stages of finishing out those uh, screens, the walkthrough screens for the user, and then the testing. So yeah, we're, we're making great progress. Everything's looking amazing. And uh, I was just doing a great job. Uh, we also had a great meeting today with our uh, privacy dev team and uh, making great progress there as well. And looking forward to kind of starting to flush that out. And, and uh, the, the scope of the project is really staying the same thing we've talked about, you know, single application with all of these different uh, like a security suite where there's many different applications plugged into one, a single UI, and uh, that's the goal, and that's what we're working on. So, yeah, things are looking great. Um, ArcLight also coming together as well. Uh, dev team working well on that, and uh, hopefully we'll get some um, more progress on that this week and, and be able to share with you uh, some things. I know everybody's waiting to hear some more details on that. Um, we still have some business things to take care of in the back end, to make sure we've we've got everything uh, structured in the right way, we know this is um, you know it's a different product than the ROI DAP. So you know there's some different things to take into consideration: uh, the way we move funds, the way that people get paid, uh, the way that people secure an account through Web 2.0 interface. So um, there's quite a few different little nuances that uh, we're taking to mind and making sure that everything's secure. And just do things the right way uh, from a business standpoint as well. So, yeah, everything's coming along great. And um, we're excited on our end. We're working really hard. And uh, can't wait to get this tarot card in everybody's hands. So that's up next. That's about it for me. I know, Atlas, you can't speak too well. <laughs> um, did you have any more Thank comments or do you want to move to the breathing? Let's do it. I'm excited. I feel like it's been a minute. Coach, are you there? I think it's time for the breathing session. Maybe he is not here right now. Yeah, oh. I'm here. I just had, I couldn't connect to my ear stuff. <laughs> oh, no problem. No problem. Can you, are you, can you there? hear me? Yes, we can. Okay. Are you ready with the music? I can be ready in one minute, 30 seconds. Okay. Are we already on <laughs> in the podcast? Oh, yeah. We're, all, we're, we're live on the podcast here. Yeah, of course. Uh, okay, great. All right. Let me see. Let me get the camera on. Uh-oh. Okay, so let's everybody relax. And oh, I'm very we're, relaxed. So we're gonna we're gonna do a circular breath in and out the mouth, like the twenty breath technique. Or you can do it like a straw. Continuous, you can do it into the belly, into the chest, or you can do a full yogi breath. And we're going to just do it circular the whole time. And uh, you do it at your pace. And we're going to have some nice music to do it. And, uh, and when the music gets going, we'll get started. But relax, you can lie down, you can sit down. I'm sitting down. And uh, keep your attention on the breath. Keep relaxing. 
and, and just notice how the breath will take you. Just remember, the connected breath is it's a circular breath where there's no pause in the inhale, the exhale. But we're doing mouth, mouth. Can you hear me? Yeah, we can hear. I'm just trying to play the song. Okay, I, tell me when the music. Sometimes I don't hear the music. I'm having issues playing the one you sent me, but there's one that comes up here. Let me just see if this sounds fine. Oh, you didn't have the, oh, the one I sent you? The bot uh, doesn't like things sometimes. If they're too large? I'm not sure. Yeah, sometimes it just doesn't. Can you hear it? The the music now? Is this fine? I can't hear it. Okay, it's kind of actually this is yeah, this is a, another version of the one you sent me. I remember I remember actually. Okay. So we got nice nice calm bells going. Meditation right. music. Sit in a comfortable yeah, and relaxed it. position. Either cross Okay, hold on. Wait. On the floor. <laughs> There's a guy talking. Or relaxed on a chair. Hold on. I'm just going to have to share my screen. One sec, coach. Sorry. Yeah. Well, that's the one. There we go. Oh, perfect. perfect. Okay, everybody, just relax. Maybe you want to close your eyes. And just observe how you're feeling. And, and slowly start breathing in and out the mouth. Slow and full breaths. And just keep relaxing. Stay with the breath. Just observe how you're feeling, any sensations, any heaviness in your body, any contractions, any pain. And just bring back your attention to the breath and just start breathing slow and full. Observe your thoughts, be aware of your thoughts, and slowly shift your attention back to your body, back to the breath. Follow the music, relax into the music. Follow the energy. Keep relaxing. Remember it's a circular breath. There's no pause between after the inhale, the exhale. Just let it all go. Just be grateful for your ability to feel whatever you're feeling.
Just know that by feeling, you're healing. Perhaps there's some thoughts you want to let go. Maybe some stress, some pain. Some anger, some sensations. You let it go by exhaling and relaxing the exhale. Pick up the speed if you want to. You can slow it down. Perhaps you want to breathe to your belly for a few minutes and then bring it up to your chest. Yeah. Just, just play with it. The key is for you just to keep following the breath. Let the breath be the teacher. You don't like closing your eyes, just stare to wherever you're sitting or lying. Just put your attention in something outside. But continue the breath. It could be a single point, it could be a total awareness of the environment. Sitting. But stay with the breath. So attention out and follow the breath. Be conscious of the breath. You're taking control of it now. now. Looking at the screen, you're watching the. You can put the attention on the Tibetan mandala. Showing up in your body, showing up in your mind. There's nothing to do except observe. Just keep breathing at your pace, maybe a little faster. Bring it up more into your heart chakra, into your heart space. And if you're sitting or lying down, you can put maybe your left hand on your heart and your right hand in your stomach and notice where you're breathing. Are you breathing more in the stomach? Are you breathing more in your chest? We're opening up the body channels, breathing through the mouth. We're activating, you're activating whatever's in the body. Stay with it. If 
notice the resistance and just relax into any resistance, but stay with the breath. Resistance shows up in thoughts, in sensations, in emotions, in pain, in tightness. And just observe it, play with it. Sometimes breathe a little faster, perhaps a little slower, depending on how you're feeling. an active inhale so when you inhale you open up and expand and then you exhale you let it go it's more passive <sighs> if you feel a little dizzy see just relax and slow it down The best, one of the best ways to get it, get rid of negativity is to experience it. So let the breath bring out whatever you need to experience. It could be in the body, it could be in the mind. And just notice it and stay, let the breath help it move, let it help move the energy. Having a little difficulty in, in, in keeping the breath, maybe take a deep breath and hold it for as long as you can. And then you let it go, and that should help you move through whatever resistance you're having. You're having. Go, you let it go, and then go back into breath. Let the breath take it. Now 
We got a few more minutes. You have to move your body, move the body, move with the energy. Slow it down. Just notice how you're feeling, notice the sensations and emotions. Perhaps you're like tingling, there's a lot of energy moving through your body, moving through your mind. Just observe it. You start slowing it down, taking slower and deeper breath. A couple more minutes. Slow it down a little bit more. Just keep observing how you're feeling, how your body's feeling. Notice your mind. Notice your thoughts. Now we're going to take a, a deep breath. Take, take, take three deep breaths. On the third one, you're going to hold. <gasps> hold it. Oh. 
and just relax, relax your body, relax your mind. listening to the music if you can hold it hold it if you can't hold it just let it go and just let the breath breathe you whatever way it's breathing keep your eyes closed perhaps connect to your heart Bring in tension. Whatever that is for you. Keep observing. Just be. Be with the energy. Slowly open your eyes. Just observe how you're feeling. Notice the space that you're in. Always come back to your breath, come back to your heart. And the A you gain from that space. Happy, healthy, wealthy, and free. Thank you for allowing me to be here and guide you in this space. If you have any questions, you want to share anything, that's fine. All the pain in my shoulders are gone. Good. That's what we carry a lot of a lot of stress there. I got locked into that one. Holy. My face and my hands were completely numb there. That was crazy. Are you sitting or lying? 
I was standing. <laughs> you stay okay, good. You're the man. I was a little tired today, so I was I was worried if I took a seat, I might fall asleep. Yeah, standing is good. Just just be careful. But it's you know that you, you can feel more energy that way. Oh yeah, I definitely had to to keep kind of rocking left and right to to feel the energy yeah. move throughout the body. And uh, yeah. I was kind of every time I was inhaling, I would go up with my with my arms, and then on the exhale, go down and push down with my arms, and that oh, yeah. felt a uh, a lot of I can I could feel like the energy kind of going through my body and just the stress being released. It was that was really nice. Thank you. Well, yes, you you got less gravity, you know, when you stand. So the so it's easier to move the energy. You know, when we're sitting, most of us are blocking energy by the way we sit. Oh, that makes sense. Yes. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. You know, you have, you have to be very flexible to be open. So, you, you know, you want your shoulders open, everything open, your fingers, you know, like you do this, you, you're blocking energy. You, you, you bend, you're blocking energy. So like if you cross your legs and, and you're not really open and flexible, you're blocking energy. Yeah, I'm sitting right now and I was sitting with my leg up and I could feel the energy being blocked. Mm -hmm. Was anyone else able to do it? If you don't, I really encourage everyone to, to do it. Honestly, like before coming into the arc, I was never really a spiritual person. I never really practiced yoga or meditation. And just being here doing this has just completely opened my whole perspective on it. So I, I just thank you for that. You're welcome. You know, thank you yourself for taking it on. You know, it's like it, it's just observing. Of course. You it's know, powerful. It's powerful. Yeah, yeah. It's connecting to, it's healing yourself. It's connecting to yourself. It's knowing your true self. And through through the breath, which is the medicine, it's, it's a gift to learn that. Not not you know you, even if you don't like yoga, you don't you have something against it. It's, don't call it yoga. Call it whatever you want to call it. <laughs> That's a good point. Yeah, get whatever you want, whatever you want out of it. Yeah. I too would be good. Thank you, Coach. Can you hear me? Yeah, In the matrix. Yes, we can hear you. No, I hear you. Thank you, Coach. It was great. All right. Very powerful. You're welcome. Anyone else? Mr. Big to it today? He likes his breathing. He does it every day. Now. Yep, I do it every day. I'm just, I'm, I fell asleep here, laying outside in my backyard. <laughs> hey, <laughs> come on, coach, what are you doing to me? <laughs> that, that, that's your, that, that's your ego saying, "Oh, I don't want to breathe." <laughs> Let me tell you what, coach. I was feeling like shit. My whole body was aching, and now I feel like I just drank a rock star. Oh, that's good. <laughs> Let's go. <laughs> Let's go. It's the big. Hey, it's just doing it, whatever is going on, just do it for a little bit, you know? Yeah, I was kind of like mistletoe. I never used to believe in that yoga bullshit, but I'm starting to get used to it now. <laughs> You, you know what yoga what yoga means? No, I don't. You'll have to no. educate me. <laughs> okay. Yeah, yoga really means union with God. Oh, union, I that. Union, union with the universe. That makes a lot of sense because I have you, God in my life. So maybe that was the last thing I needed to hook up. You know, and it, it, it's like. It's, and, and yoga is about quiet the mind so you can connect 
to your true self, to God, to the universe, whatever you want to call it. And, 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 and that's the original yoga. The original yoga was to quiet their mind, to connect. And then what, what happened is that they, they, as they quiet their mind, they felt all the, the blockage in the body. So the Indians started like, you know, movements and stuff to be able to release the blockage. And that's how the yoga uh, movement started coming. But it was more a quiet the mind so so they can get away from the mind so, so they could connect. Yeah, then, I hope they... And, I hope yoga can help my tinnitus because I've tried every freaking thing in the world. So maybe if I really practice, I can get rid of my tinnitus because, Coach, I would give it my left arm if I could get rid of my tinnitus. It is so bad lately. It's like a freight train running through my ear 24-7. Through the ear? Huh? Try some, try some Moringa. Yeah. The, the, the enemy, remember, you know, we're getting a Zoom call and see if I can. Oh, I sure uh, appreciate it. Every supplement, every hearing thing, every, I even just ordered some new eardrops that are supposed to work, but nothing's ever worked. So if I, I know your brain can heal a lot of stuff, but maybe I'm just going about it the wrong way. I'll, I'll get in touch with you sometime and maybe we can work on it. Thank you very much, coach. Okay. You're welcome. Anyone All right. else? Anybody else? Calm, cool, and collected. My wife did it. She's super happy. Said hi. I can barely hear you. Matrix coach. He said uh, yeah. his wife did it, and she said hi. Oh, uh, hi. <laughs> uh, great. Hey, Alice, yesterday in my, uh, in the, in the ceremony, the, they brought the, the uh, wave drum. Oh. Yeah, man. (laughs) (laughs) Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. They they had the wave drum there, and and then the the yogi that was you know she was doing all the sound balls and everything she kind of liked it and she was like the whole time going <laughs> it's amazing right the sound is so yeah 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 yeah, yeah. It's great, it's great. how big was it? it it was pretty big like like this big you know that's huge <laughs> <laughs> that sounded like a tsunami that a wave <laughs> <laughs> it's 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 amazing like like you, you can do it and, and and put it you know like when there's a lot of people like you can put it like right over them it's like the wave is coming right into them. <laughs> it's when you're on that 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 five D and T trip with the bow. <laughs> oh my god. Very, very relaxing. Yeah. <laughs> Happy days. Happy days. Happy days. Uh, Let's do right. this And uh, our friend, uh, our, our friend Mistletoe, he, he is, um, no, no, he's here. I mean, our friend Z, he's, he's uh, having connection issues. Oh, no. Is he out on the beach? And I'm thinking crack pop. Weird thing on my audio. Really weird. I'm having an issue with my audio? I am. Oh, you are? Yeah. I'm hearing a strange thing yeah. in the background. Oh, no. Uh, okay. We're we still haven't do done part. the wheel of the toad yet. All right. Let's do it. <clears throat> awesome. This is the wheel of the toad our daily all aboard contest we do every single day here on board the ark i know a lot of you are familiar with it but if you're listening to the recording you're not here live how to get entered is super simple every single day after the podcast we post a new sweep widget link it's posted in the main chat 
in the contest and giveaway topic, and as well as in the announcements channel. It's super easy to find. If you can never find it, always be sure to ask. We'll always repost it for you. Once you find that new sweep widget link, you're going to click onto that link. It's going to redirect you to a task list. Those tasks are going to range from liking and, comment, liking and commenting on the daily ARC podcast uploaded over to YouTube, liking and commenting on the, the shorts over there, clapping up some Medium articles, retweeting some Twitter links, or even there's one on there, leave a review on Trustpilot. If you've already left a review, I do, I do really encourage everyone to go comment on each other's reviews, like them all up. It really does help. A lot of people use that trust pilot. So yeah, once you go through all of those tasks there, your name is going to pop up on this amazing iHeart Arc wheel where every single day, live on the podcast, we spin it to find our lucky winner of $50 worth of Arc. Super simple, really takes a couple minutes of your time. Even if you don't win, you always have tomorrow and you're always helping push the algorithm for everyone here on board the Arc helping push those daily podcasts, those shorts, those medium articles. It really does help the community get the word out. So uh, thank you for everyone that participates. I really encourage everyone to, to get in there. It only takes a couple minutes and get your chance to win some free crypto. So without further ado, let's spin that wheel and find our lucky winner for tonight. Good luck, everyone. Oh, Johnny Fawcett. It's been a while since we've seen him on the wheel. Congratulations, you won $50 worth of ARC. And uh, that is our winner for the All Aboard. Back to you, Atlas, for the Sparky. All right. Here we will do it. Here we go. You can see that, sir. I uh, don't see it. Oh, there we go. Now I see it. 850 arc. Let's go. Who's going to be the lucky winner for tonight? Is it going to be someone here live in the call? Who knows? Let's see. Not Maybe the coat. Maybe it's sense. Mr. Big. Maybe it's Justin McDonald. Oh, he likes winning. Mr. Big loves to win Spark. Yeah, I sure would, boy. It's only been a few months. Come on, Sparky! Sparky, Sparky, Sparky! All right. Here we go. All right, it is on its way. Drum roll. <laughs> no, since we're in the matrix, that would make it extra <laughs> uh, difficult. <laughs> there it is. <laughs> Today, winner, there will all ends in E. Four one four, one six hundred sixty-five. Are they are first and the NP their wallet ends in zero eight nine nine, taking in eighty-five point zero one. Nitro boost of we're gonna shoot tonight. End of the past, Mr. Z. Connection issues. He won't be available today. We're gonna put the, the recording hang for a little bit. Just and doing. Be back tomorrow, same time, 4 p.m. EST, 8 p.m. UTC. We'll see you all there tomorrow.